navigating the delicate balance between moral duty and pragmatic considerations. This news exclusively on CBS News. The Biden administration is considering a plan to allow some Palestinian refugees to come here to the United States. That's according to internal federal government documents that were obtained by CBS's Camilo Montoya Galvez. According to the plan, some Palestinians fleeing the war would be offered a permanent safe haven here in the U.S. And one option under consideration is to allow those who have immediate family members who are either American citizens or permanent residents to enter the country if they pass various background checks first. The plans would require coordination with Egypt, which has so far refused to allow large numbers of people from Gaza to cross the border into that country. While recognizing the compassionate inclination to offer sanctuary to Palestinians, it's imperative to weigh the associated risks. An in-depth examination of the proposed strategy is essential, taking into account its implications on national security, diplomatic ties with Egypt, and the well-being of both refugees and their host communities. Addressing this issue demands a nuanced perspective, focusing on heritage, stability, and safeguarding national interests. Given the intricate nature of the Israeli-Palestinian conflict, apprehensions arise regarding the potential repercussions of admitting Palestinian refugees, spanning culture, economy, and security domains. This situation prompts inquiries into the feasibility of their assimilation into American society and the potential strain on resources and social cohesion. Emotions play a significant role in the discourse surrounding refugees and immigration, influencing perceptions and policy formulations. Understanding the interplay of empathy, apprehension, and cultural allegiance is crucial in shaping public opinion and governmental decisions.